Hello YouTube, King Duke Knight one here, back with some more Pokemon Insurgents. I, um, made a bunch of trips all over. I was a- I decided to train Ralts a little bit. I got it. One level. And that's it. But, I looked up where to get the lucky egg, and we are actually on our way to getting it. We're pretty close to the lucky egg, so we're gonna go grab it. Also, you may have noticed that the title of my game is a little bit different. I actually installed the title pack, or the, um, font pack, so, yeah. Not title is different, the font is different. So, yeah. That's all of what I did while I was off doing stuff. Emolga. Electric flying. Alright then. Furfru. I have to change because if I don't, well, I can't hit the Furfru. This is a normal type. Uh, Flame Burst. Flame Burst. That was an easy fight. That was not a fair battle. Yes, it was. You challenged me. There's flowettes here. Interesting. I never actually checked what was all on this route. My neck. Touch it. Feel my neck. What? Oh. Oh. Okay. Right, you're part dark type. I forgot. We're gonna use one of these revives. Um, I actually went all the way back to the very beginning of the game. Like, the very beginning area. And remember, like, I was gonna go train, uh, Ralts there. And then I remembered that, um... Well... Like, so... Oh, yes! Oh, goodbye, mean look. Mawile. Okay, so l let me finish my thought here. So, I was playing Pokemon Gla when I was recording Pokemon Glazed. I discovered that there are some trainers that you can fight over and over and over and over again, and their Pokemon never get any stronger. So, Pokemon Glazed kind of blended in with this game, and I went all the way back to the beginning of the game looking for that trainer, and then I realized, oh wait, that was in Pokemon Glazed, not in Pokemon Insurgents. So, I had gone all that way for literally nothing. Let's go back and heal now. <gasps> Hypnosis. Oh, that's psychic type. Right. There's Glammy House here. I'm sorry. What? You can get servines here. Oh. Uh, chuck an ultra ball. Gotcha. Oh. Wrong button. Hypnosis. He'll get its health, and then I'm gonna use Dream Eater and get my health. Oh, hypnosis missed. Um. Okay, you know what? We're just gonna run. Crap. Okay, I need- I really need to heal. Like, badly, here. 
So, th thankfully, it's not too far of a walk to Vipic City. Alright. Um, so... I have, like, 10k here, and we're... 12k. We're gonna use it to buy... 16k, apparently. We're gonna use it to buy, um, revives. How many can I get? 11, huh? Um... We'll get 5. I have 8 hi super potions. 3 hi potions. Um, how many of these can I get? 13. 8. And then we'll get 3 ultra balls. Awesome. Alrighty. <sighs> Did I heal? Yes, I did. Okay. I couldn't remember if I healed or not. Alrighty, so... I want to catch a Rosalia. Male, preferably. Growlers are here. Do I have a Firestone? No. Hmm. Wait a minute, what does this spell tag do? I should probably give that to someone, huh? Um, we're not gonna fight. But we're gonna get that, give that spell tag. I should have done this before. We're gonna give it to Oven. Um. We're going to give this magnet to Sexy here. Alrighty, now we're gonna save. And find myself a Rosalia, because Rosalias are amazing. It has to be male. Um. Can I not kill it with Dream Eater? N nope. Okay. Oh, see, actually, no, that's a bad idea. Wait, what are my Pokemon at the moment? I don't have a flying Pokemon, although fly might not be needed in this game. I was gonna grab it because it's a flying type, but I already have a fire flying type on my team, and... But, see, the thing is, Talonflame is really freaking cool, but we're not gonna bother with Talonflame. Another Growlithe. Another Fletchling. I prefer female Talon Flames as well because they look better than the male variant. Ditto's here. Wait, I'm I'm on the route before. Actually, I'm on I'm not on the right route here. Yeah, here we are. Now I'm on the right route. I should remember that. Oh, 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 oh! You have Intimidate though. Give me one second. Okay, so... I looked it up. You cannot catch... Shinx... Anywhere. Other than a Delta Shinx, and I don't like the way the Delta Shinx looks. So, Hypnosis... Hypnosis, please. Okay, thank god. Oh god, okay. Okay, its health is low enough. I need to catch this thing, and now. <clears throat> okay, so. It has eyes that can see through anything. It spots and captures prey hiding behind objects. So. No, I don't... I don't want to give a nickname to that. We're gonna go heal. Um, I'm gonna sell some stuff that I don't need as well here, so give me one second. Okay, let's sell the stuff that I don't need. Not buy. Sell. 
Alright, um, I'm not gonna use the... Nah, uh, I'll keep it just in case. Um... Stardust, this sells for a thousand. Oh, I can't sell TMs, okay. Um... Well, I can't really sell anything else. That sucks. I have Ultra Balls, Great Balls, and Pokeballs, though, so... Okay, so... What what I need to do is I need to catch a Roselia and then another Shinx, or Luxray, rather. And then when we get to the daycare, I'm going to breed them and get myself a Shinx, hopefully with rivalry. Because that is, like, the best ability. There's a Glammeow. Servine. Male. I need a female. Or... I could catch a ditto, but dittos have like really low catch rates anyways as it is, and I don't want to go through the process of trying to capture a ditto and running out of Pokeballs. Okay, bag. Right, no, 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 no. Fight, hypnosis. Awesome, okay. Fight, dream eater. Okay, fight hypnosis. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, hypnosis. Sweet. Alright. Nightshade. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Sorry, Oven. I am sorry for using you as bait. Bag. Ultra Ball. Ultra Ball. Got it. Okay, so now we can breed myself a Shinx when we get to the daycare. Oh, that scared me. No, I'm not going to give it a Nick's name. So now we're going to go back and heal yet again. Did anyone else see that? I'm hoping you guys saw that and why I started attacking it. Its ability was rivalry. Okay, no, no, no it's 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 fine. It's fine. It's fine. We have two looks raised. Don't push. The, don't push my luck. But we do need a Roselia here. We need a Grass type on our team, not a Servine. Roselia because Rose Raid is amazing. Not a Floet either. I need a Roselia. You know what? Let's go over here. So when, when we get to the town where I can breed, I am going to um, breed a male Luxray that has the ability Rivalry, and I will go I will go stick with it as long as I can, dude. All right, we need to catch ourselves Roselia here. Okay, I'll be back once I run into Roselia. After much searching, I finally found one. Also, I looked. I just decided to look up the uh, Pokedex on Pokemon Insurgents, and you can only get Shinxes by breeding. So, yeah. Uh, Hypnosis. Nightshade. Nightshade. Hypnosis. Hypnosis. Alright. Go 
Got it. All right. So now we have ourselves a Rosalia. Rosalia. A, a, a Rosalia that drinks nutritionally rich spring water blooms with lovely flowers. The fragrance of its flowers has the effect of making its foes careless. So we're not going to give it a nickname. Uh, we will go back and get it at some point. Not right now, though. Or I could just beat you in a in a match. Get wrecked, Cricketune. You have a Polyrath, you say. Put it to sleep. Put it to sleep, quick! Okay. Now kill it with Dream Eater, because it's part fighting type. Oh, come on! <laughs> the thing can't hit me, that's great. I'm sorry, I'm sorry! You better be. You can go in for free, I lied. Dang right. Kick your butt. Alright, save. So, I did look it up. Apparently there are crashes with Luxray, but only if you move the, use the move Thunderfang. And that can also happen with Tyrant and other Pokemon, so... You just don't use Thunderfang and you're fine. What is this? Is this a Pokemon lab? Scientist Club. Have you give us a hand? Not all of us are experienced battlers. Interesting. I'm the leader of the scientist club. If you ever wanted to see the behind the scenes, I'm sure we could find a project for you to help out on. Well, what do you say? Do you want to join us? Sure. Great, we're glad to have you join us. I actually have a mission you can start off with. Basically, uh, well, we have a lab we're running experiments on very ancient Pokemon. However, just a few hours ago, one of the Pokemon escaped and is now freeing all of them. It's complete havoc. Could you deal with them? Not being trainers, we don't we don't dare getting close to them. We still got plenty locked up, so even just catching them or making them faint would help us out immensely. Would you be able to help us? Sure. Thanks a lot. Don't worry, we'll pay you all for this. We'll start with the Archon. There we go. Oh. Didn't know they were level 5. If I catch them, they probably won't be mine either, so... Get, 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 there we go. You have multiple leaps, multiple Omanites, and I only saw one Archon so far. Gotcha. Why am I using Shadow Ball? Just use, dr just use Nightshade, dude. Oh. Well, that explains what's freeing them. This thing's gonna be like a really high level, isn't it? The Cobotops is a strange metal device attached to its back. Oh, someone's taking control of it. Oh, it's not that high of a level. <clears throat> You know what? Let's see if we can catch it. Got it. Kabutats once swam underwater to hunt for prey. It was apparently evolving from... It, it was apparently evolving from being a water dweller to living on land as evident from its changes in its gills and legs. 
Hey, my Kabutops. That Kabutops was the cause of all our problems. It escaped its enclosure was trying to free the rest of them. Let me just remove this machine from it. There, I think we can chalk that experiment up to a failure. Never mind, we can deal with the cleanup from here. Thanks to all your help, Chris. Take this as a reward. Wow. We'll call on your poker gear. Call you on your poker gear if we need anything from you. Wow. Cool. This thing has it. <laughs> There's the lucky egg. My husband's been complaining ever since those scientists built that lab here. I don't see the problem. It's all in good fun. Anyone can join, and they even offer payment for doing short favors. It's not like they interfere with your adventure at all, either. I'm scientists are taking over my coral town. Grr, they're darn club and they're darn kids trying to educate my kids. Oh, sorry. Grr, they're darn club and they're darn trying to educate my kids. It grinds my, my uh, metal. Never you mind, but I don't like them. Okay, well, they're not bad. Thanks for the lucky egg, Loudred. Much appreciated. Oh, hello, Great Ball. I need you. Where's the Pokemon set? Oh, there it is. Question answered. Awesome. The Rezai Desert is an artist's paradise. Beautiful rocks in the sand, and the rocks in the sand, and the rocks. Actually, on second thought, I forget I said anything at all. You probably have a friend and a social life. Ha, how lame. I've got video game. Okay. I saw a bunch of creeps in town earlier. They're all dressed in green hoods and headed for the desert. I wonder what that was all about. Maybe they're after Rayquaza? Could be the Delta Cult, I guess? Like those cracked rocks around the region, I heard boulders can be pushed by moves too. I've had success with Steamroll, Roland, and Bulldoze, but I'm sure there are a ton more that work. Is that a stock market, stock market in the corner of town? Who would do that? Who would consider running a stock market when Pokemon exist? Sheesh of all things to have around here. I'm a lawyer. I do lawyer things. If you ever need someone to do lawyer things, I'm the lawyer for the job. <laughs> okay. I'd love to be able to fly over the Torrin region, but that Brendan kid could... But that Brendan kid could... Could... Like that Brendan could, kid could back in Hoenn all those years ago. Oh, that's a reference to... um. Uh, Ruby Sapphire Emerald. I think you, uh, if he he's either talking about your rival when you were May, or you when you were the guy. Who knows? Maybe sometime in the near future I'll be able to do that. Did you know that Drifloon drags the souls of children away? Charming. Or that Banette is the spirit of a thrown away doll seeking its revenge on on its owner? Yes, I know that one. Some Pokemon really are creepier and darker than they first appear. I guess. Oh, one second again. Let me pause. I'll be right back. Just one second. Okay. That was really quickly. I'm sorry for all the pause in this episode. I was just uh, checking out where I could evolve my Haunter again. It's, I have to be in Helio City in the Black Market. It came from Route 5, yeah? There's a huge mass of caves in there called the Samsara Cave. I'd love to explore it myself, but you need Waterfall to get deep in. Sounds like Mount Silver. Coral is the e economic stronghold of the region. That's why we have a stark stock market here. We also produce all the currency in Torrent. Wow. That explains the stock market, then. I guess. Have you been into Samsara Cave? The bottom part is easy enough to venture into, but you need Waterfall to explore the bulk of it. My favorite Pokemon is Cast Form. Now, before you laugh at me, yes, I know what it looks like. That doesn't make it any less adorable, okay? To each their own. My favorite Pokemon's Luxray. Which is why I caught a Luxray. No, I want them. Welcome to Little Coral Town. We don't have much, but but what we have, we sh we share. Sea incense. Enjoy your stay. Cool. Sea incense and ups the power of water type moves. That's nice to have. <laughs> All right. Let's go see the stock. Oh, oh that's the Loudred House. Let's go see. Wait, what's up here? Actually. 
Some people in green suits came running by here earlier. I wonder what they were up to. Let's go see the stock market. Hello. Unfortunately, the stock market is closed right now. Why come? Okay, then. Gee. Don't need to be rude. Gosh. Have you ever heard of... Have you ever heard of the new moon weather condition? It's only been recently discovered, but it's pretty neat. Sort of like the opposite of sunny day. The sky changes to pitch black night. Powers up dark and ghost type moves, but lowers fairy ones. Certain abilities get triggered when that happens too. Not to mention, if you use moonlight as well, it'll probably re increase the restoration of the move moonlight, so... Travelers be warned, the sandstorm is always harsh in the Rezai Desert. Come prepared. You know what? Before we go into the Rezai Desert, I want to go look... Um, what was in here? In this so-called cave. Is that a hyper potion? Yes, it is. Nice. Wow. Great ball, cool. <sighs> kind of funny that a ghost type would like the friggin... Oh, hi! Good place to train in here, actually. He's level 36. Hi, Bulldor! Dirty. Let's see what else we have in this cave. <gasps> oh! Oh. Okay. Little tones are in here too. Cool. Let's see if we can run into that little thing again. Bulldor can be scary with that smackdown. There you are. Okay, um... We'll let Salamander deal with it, I guess. Kind of... Dangerous. Screw the Larvitar. What's in the water? I, I, I shouldn't be checking that. Wag tires are in here, but I shouldn't be checking that while I have a freaking Pokemon that's like low health. Alright, so we know that Quag tires are in there. I'm not going to check the rest of it. But I am, however, going to go over here. Alright, we're going to heal. Open up the PC, move Pokemon. Swift Swim, huh? Let's look at your stats. Uh, likes to fight. Pretty good attack stat. Other stats are pretty cool too, speed's not bad. Mudshot, Sand Attack, and Endure, and Aqua Jet. He's not bad, Cobotop's pretty good. You have... you have a poison barb, huh? Sorry, Jaws. 
intimidate. They're gonna be bre uh, bred. Sweet scent, huh? Natural cure. Giga drain, toxic spice, sweet scent, and ingr ingrain. Wow, okay, you will be really, really easy to freaking train. Now, I just need a dawn stone for it. Alrighty, so, we're gonna go over here to the next area, and I'm gonna make a save right here as well. As soon as we get in here. Yeah. Alright. We'll save here. Whatever. Considering this area... Giga Drain has 10 power points. Well, considering this is a ground area, we're gonna bring out Roselia. Ugh, the sandstorm is terrible. It's worth it's worth it though to find Pokemon in the desert. You have oh level 39. Yikes. Um Giga Drain. Alright then. Let me guess, you have a saw rock next. Yep. Wow, saw rock is like less health than Lunatone. Alright, well, Rip Roselia. Only the bravest fighters could possibly bear the brunt of the desert. This desert also is very barren. Gravel, huh? Okay. Lyron. Lyron is part steel type. Steel rock, I believe, so... This should do a fair bit of damage to it. Yeah. I'll take it out as well. <sighs> uh, yes. Yeah, that's, uh... Um... I'm gonna get rid of Dragon... Mm, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of Dragon Rage. Shot. Oh. oh, no. Oh, no. It's back. Kill it with... Fire. Okay, no, just nightshade it to all hell. You don't fuckle with shuckle. Right. Why aren't you a hiker? That's not allowed. We gonna go heal now. There's a popotoss in here. Alrighty, let's go heal. Alrighty. Some, you know, sometimes I forget I even have the space bar held down. I forgot to mention as well, my speed up button, speed up thing is different again. I changed it to ludicrous speed. Doesn't really change much though. Ooh, super potion. I'll take that. And we'll fight this ruined maniac. Should someone as young as you really be in the desert? It can be a very dangerous place. 
Yes, it's obvious. Ah! <laughs> Why? I'm not sure if I fought this guy earlier. But it's Indiana Jones again. Nah. <laughs> the bad pun. Rune Maniac Indiana. Oh. Hello, Flygon. I don't want you, though. Oh, great ball. I'll take that. Sometimes traveling through a sandstorm, people can find items blown and carried away. Minor Brady would like to battle. He has a Torkoal! Okay. Yep, putting that right to sleep. Have scary. You have very scary. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Oh, you have terrifying. You have more terrifying. Should I chance it and hope it uses explosion? No. I was probably going to use Rock Blast. Stealth Rock. Well, Starman's my only hope now. Get him, Roselia. Okay. You just gave me your money, though. You gave me your money willingly! I'm not a thief! When you lose a Pokemon battle, you're supposed to pay the winner their money. And you gave me money. You challenged me to a battle, in fact. I walked in front of you. Good God. On a side note, I have, like, no more money this month. I'm, like, almost all out because I, uh, went and pre-ordered, um, Pokemon Sun, Pokemon Sun, and then also I, um, I bought Ocarina of Time, which I got halfway through the game in about two days, but I want to say 12 hours. I, I kind of sped through a bunch of dungeons. I mean, I'm in the Shadow Temple at the moment, and I... Uh, Shadow Temple. Oh boy, you have a looks ray, don't you? You have a Kumi! It's adorable! It's so cute! Kill it like the rest. I will take Rain Dance over sun Sandstorm. Thank you. The Den. That's the little... Yeah! Hypnosis. And kill it before it can use thunder. Good god. 
Electric fairy type. God dang, that took a while. Yes. Goodbye, Nightshade. Delibird, huh? Put it to sleep. Uh oh. Oh, it has Vital Spirit. So, okay, Dark Pulse. That looked freaking cool, dude. That looks awesome. You, you go ahead and be insured, whatever you say. Oh, there's Croc Rocks here. Alright. Gotcha. Now, the reason why I caught a Croc Rock is because crocodiles are scary, man. The special membrane covering its eyes can sense the heat of objects, so it can see its surroundings, even in darkness. In other words, it has, um, thermal vision. I should have nicknamed him. I should have nicknamed him Deal With It. Should have nicknamed him Deal With It. It would have been funny. Alright. So, we've completely cleared the desert of trainers so far. I'm hoping that the guys that went in that one area, though, have like ground types. So, we're gonna save here. And I'm gonna end the episode here. Uh, so... If you enjoyed, comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Let me get videos out there. Let me just guys like, and I'll see everyone in the next video. I'm going to record right after this, but I have to use the bathroom first. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in like a few minutes. So, yeah.